Montelukast is a leukotriene receptor antagonist used for the maintenance treatment of asthma and to relieve symptoms of seasonal allergies. Montelukast comes as a tablet, a chewable tablet, and granules to take by mouth. Montelukast is usually taken once a day with or without food. Montelukast is a CYSLT1 antagonist. It blocks the action of leukotriene D4 on the cysteinol leukotriene receptor CYSLT1 in the lungs and bronchial tubes by binding to it. This reduces the bronchoconstriction otherwise caused by the leukotriene and results in less inflammation. Because of its method of operation, it is not useful for the treatment of acute asthma attacks. Again because of its very specific mechanism of action, it does not interact with other asthma medications such as theophylline. Another leukotriene receptor antagonist is Zaflucast, taken twice daily. Xylitin, an asthma drug taken four times per day, blocks leukotriene synthesis by inhibiting 5-lipoxygenase, an enzyme of the acosinoid synthesis pathway. The Mont in Montelukast stands for Montreal, the place where Merck developed the drug. Medical uses Montelukast is used for a number of conditions including asthma, exercise-induced bronchospasm, allergic rhinitis, and urticaria. It is mainly used as a complementary therapy in adults in addition to inhaled corticosteroids, if they alone do not bring the desired effect. Montelukast is administered as Montelukast sodium, with 5.2 mg of Montelukast sodium being equivalent to 5 mg of Montelukast. Adverse effects Side effects include gastrointestinal disturbances, headaches, hypersensitivity reactions, sleep disorders, and increased bleeding tendency, in addition to other generic adverse reactions. Its use is associated with a higher incidence of Churga-Urow-Strauss syndrome. Drowsiness is also a common side effect. FDA investigation, in March 2008. The U.S. Food and Drug Administration announced that it would investigate whether mood changes and suicidal thoughts are possible side effects of drugs in this class, including the popular drug Singular, which currently lists these side effects. On June 12, 2009, the FDA concluded their review into the possibility of neuropsychiatric side effects with leukotriene modulator drugs. Although clinical trials only revealed an increased risk of insomnia, Post-marketing surveillance showed that the drugs are associated with a possible increase in suicidal behavior and other side effects such as agitation, aggression, anxiousness, dream abnormalities and hallucinations, depression, irritability, restlessness, and tremor. Use with loratadine, sharing Plow and Merck sought permission to market a combined tablet with loratadine and Montelukast, as many patients combine the two themselves. However, the FDA has found no benefit from a combined pill for seasonal allergies overtaking the two drugs in combination, and on April 25, 2008, issued a not approvable letter for the combination. Dosage and administration The usual dose of Montelukast in adults and teenagers is one 10 mg tablet taken orally a day. In children 6 to 14 years of age the usual dosage is 1 5 mg chewable tablet a day children 6 months to 6 years old 4 mg granules once daily, patents, singular was covered by US patent number 5565473 which expired on August 3, 2012. The same day, the FDA approved several generic versions of Montelukast. The United States Patent and Trademark Office launched a re-examination of the patent covering Singular on May 28, 2009. The decision was driven by the discovery of references that were not included in the original patent application process. The references were submitted through Article 1 Partners, an online research community focused on finding literature relating to existing patents. The references included a scientific article produced by a Merck employee on the active ingredient in Singular. A previously filed patent had been submitted in the same technology area. Seven months later the U.S. Patent and Trademark Office determined that the patent in question was valid based on the initial re-examination and new information provided, submitting their decision on December 17, 2009. References External links U.S. National Library of Medicine, Drug Information Portal, Montelukast